Hey y'all, it's Chris Starlight here. It's a hot, wonderful Sunday morning in Trinidad. So I decided to do a little face video for y'all today. Sorry, I've been posting the last couple of days. I had a lot going on and I was busy with housework and running down the little one. Well now, so uh, for this video, we I decided to come and talk about the fact that in Trinidad, the government has decided to close down Petrotrin refinery. That's where all the oil and gas comes from. When that made news, and it was all over the internet, I was scared and shocked at the same time. Because one, my dad works for that company. Two, I know a lot of people who work in Petrotrin for the oil refinery. And three, it doesn't make any sense. You're closing down the oil, the refinery. You're gonna start to import gas. It's obvious. The prices in the gas station are going to raise. Taxis are gonna raise their fare. All them cars are gonna raise their fare. Everything is going to raise. What will happen to the poor man in the country? And not just Trinidad alone. All over the world, people having money problems and all them kind of thing. And not to mention the fact that sem over 1,700 workers getting fired from Petrotrin because of the, the fact that the refinery closing now. When I hear that and I read that, I was like, what the hell, boy, this government, the country don't suffer enough. They're just trying to make it more worse. And the fact that they, fa them, the fact that they fire 1,700 people, it going to increase the crime rate. They're gonna have a lot more robbing, stealing, shooting, killing, you name it. But the government apparently they don't care about that. Instead they try to make things easier for people and for the poor people. Them don't want to do that. They prefer to go and import everything from other countries, make living hard for the other poor people who can't really say pull out a whole set of money to pay for stuff. They're just sickening. Anyways, we gotta sit down, God. We're still trying to make it out here. I'm trying to survive. Work, save money. Some form of change will happen. Just have faith. And pray. Oh, yeah. And also, too, I read this morning that, if I'm not mistaken, last night or yesterday, I believe it was last night, a 4.0 magnitude earthquake hit off the coast of Venezuela somewhere there. If I no mistaken, I can't really remember exactly where, but it was somewhere in Venezuela. I see it was on the news on Facebook this morning. It was on my news feed. So I must say my prayers goes all to the people of Venezuela. I didn't feel we didn't feel anything. Maybe it might get a little aftershock, but probably I was asleep. Prayers goes out to Venezuela. Hope you all safe, family safe, everything doing well. Just pray. God will help all you. That is all I have for all today. Going back to my regular housework. Enjoy your day. Peace.